Kathleen Leighton. And I'm Keith Ramsey. On the scene and joins us live now with the latest. Rich. Well, that's right, uh, Marty and Lori. The uh, explosion and fire happened here at Fanny's Night Spot on Sheridan Drive in Amherst. It happened sometime after 9 o'clock tonight. Uh, fire investigators tell us two employees were filling table lanterns in the kitchen when fumes apparently caught fire from an ignition source uh, from the kitchen somewhere. The flames burned the uh, male workers, both of them male, that is, one of them seriously. Another man and a woman employee were injured in the frantic scrambling around. Ken Boutelier and his wife were having dinner when the flames broke out tonight. We were having dinner and, uh, and there was an explosion. It was a fireball. It was, it, was an, it was intense. It blew the doors open enough for us to see through the mirrors. And the kid was screaming and uh, we went to his assistance and uh, tried to, you know, him and I, you know, helped uh, pull the victims out until uh, we got uh, 911 to send us some uh, paramedics. Ken Boutelier said that the a kid, as he referred to the employee, was burned from the waist down. He said all of his clothes, all of his uh, pants, rather, were melted off. Only his belt was left. The skin was gone in his lower body. He was taken along with his co-worker to ECMC tonight, where they're being treated. We have no word on their condition at this moment, but based on the explanations that we heard tonight and the description of the victims, uh, at least one of them appears to have been seriously burned tonight here at Fanny's. All right, Rich Kalman, thanks very much for that story tonight. Front leaves one worker with serious burns. Fire officials say a waiter was filling a kerosene candle when it ignited. Witnesses say the waiter's lower body was engulfed in flames. Two other employees sustained minor injuries. All three were taken to ECMC's burn center tonight. Minor explosion at Fanny's restaurant. Witnesses say four employees were refilling table lanterns when one of those lanterns burst into flames. Uh, none of the patrons was injured, but tonight three employees remain hospitalized with burns. One has been treated and released. There was no damage to the restaurant.